uh, the aqua ablation system basically uses a high pressure water jet uh, system, which is kind of ultrasound guided, uh, pre-planned, and then it's a robotic technology that basically stimulates the treatment for the high pressure water jet. So it has the ability to uh, vaporize prostate tissue in a quicker amount of time than some of the other traditional operations um, without the use of temperature, which is very important with some of these prostate surgeries is that the lack of thermal heat uh, that's utilized to treat the prostate gland. It's just transurethral surgery. Um, again, we use an ultrasound in the rectum to, to map out the prostate gland and create our treatment template. Uh, then we put the, the kind of the robotic driven uh, scope through the urethra into the bladder and then that's where we do the prostate treatment and then after the operation they get a catheter put in to uh, let everything heal. The benefits of this is less operative time, uh, the lack of thermal injury, but they do typically spend one, at, one night in the hospital. Again, some people are sending it home the same day, but at this point we're still keeping them just overnight just to be cautious. The benefit of aqua ablation is once you do that initial template and the mapping, which takes 15 minutes, 10-15 minutes, um, the treatment of the actual robotic uh, you know, water jet therapy is basically a four minute treatment. We usually do that treatment two times, so you're looking at eight minutes of treatment as opposed to an hour, hour and a half of actual laser ablation and, and heat you know, technology to remove prostate tissues. So those men who are, have been on medication and have been intolerant to medication or um, you know, continue to have ongoing obstructive voiding symptoms, there's some strict criteria that we uh, utilize to include patients that are um, available for that particular procedure. So it's not meant for everybody, um, but there are uh, you know, some kind of preoperative workup that needs to be done in order to determine if they're a candidate. The fact that we now here at, at CAMC have the ability to offer you know, a, a less invasive, you know, non-thermal treatment with shorter operative times, quick recoveries, uh, preservation of sexual function, um, you know, aqua ablation is, is a great option for these patients. Um, but the fact that you know we, we're not using high uh, heat energy, we're able to preserve sexual function, and we can treat much larger glands, you know, with this technology at shorter operative times is, is kind of what's you know special about this new technology.